Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler. Welcome back to Ostrov. We've got a harvest coming in. They're uh, taking the wheat right now. In fact, if we zoom in a little bit, we should see a... Is that a scythe or a sickle? I always, I always mix those two up. Actually, I'm not seeing it now. I've always seen it before. But I don't see it in their hands now. Normally, there'd be a, you know, a curved blade right there. I've seen it in, in previous episodes. Interesting. Or patch four changed something. I don't think I've actually looked at it since then. Huh. Oh well. That's a little different. Anyway, the harvest is coming in, and how do we do? We got to real close to three quarter. That was a good run right there. Over here we should have not done so well, and we hit almost half. This was the one that was planted way late. Sunflower over here, and about five eighths. Same. A little bit more, and more, and the most, based upon when the seed actually got in the ground. Yeah. All right, so with that going on, what else are we up to? May as well get this guy going, continue, just because it's it's so close and so much of it's done already. We're working on the trader. Uh, we have a laborer bringing something over. Oh, he's putting. He must be putting his cart away because it's not calling for anything. Yeah, he's, he's done. And we've got three houses to work on. So let's kick the speed up a little bit. And see how this goes. Um, what to do in here. So we've got... Take it down to two so it doesn't get too far ahead of me. Uh, carrying water now. Let's go back to that for a second. Where are you? You're right there. So you dropped off the cart. You're carrying water. Then you're heading into the new little park area that I just finished before I start the episode. And they're going to sit down and take a rest. And then we'll start planning these buildings. But let's... I'm curious what happens next. We've got... I didn't turn any... Let's pause here. Any workers on. We're just going to let the, uh, the laborers do the job. Not as big of a rush this time. We just have to have it done by November. But we don't have to worry about trying to plant it as fast as we can so we can get the most growth out of the field. So it's not as big of a race here. So, but there are some jobs available here. There's plenty of jobs available in there. All that to say, where's Ola's going to go next? Or is he going to spend the next five minutes <laughs> defying my wish to see where he's going to go next? <laughs> uh, now we're going to grab a cart. And he is... No, he's going to go sit down again. And now he's going to go to work. He is right there. Called in to be a worker to finish assembling the trader. Okay. So that's the life of an Ostrivian. Is that the name we should give them? Ostrivians. And because we got rid of this house here, we've lost a fence. Let's see if we can fix that. That would be this one. What's the closest that I'm allowed? Ooh, I am allowed to go there. Really? Interesting. So if I go a little bit further, I hit. But uh, at this point, it's still outside of the boundary. Okay, good. That cleaned that up. Now, this area is bugging me. Let's come up with an answer here. If we were to sight down this pathway here, see if I can tap this over a little bit. There. We've got a pretty good run right here. Pretty straight run. This building's going to jog it in, drag into it a little bit, but otherwise this looks pretty good. They're carrying a log. Yeah, we've got the house over here being built, and they're taking the uh, the trees out of it. Ah, okay. Uh, fishing, how are we doing here? we got four people lined up, no fish stored, because they're taking it as fast as, as they can make it at this point. Let's go ahead and put a fifth person in, and let's just try to keep all three fishing boats out here uh, for the rest of this year. Next year we'll have some houses over here. We won't have to, to bribe them to come to work. That'll be nice. And uh, we'll then have, hopefully, well by that point next year we will have used up every bit of fish that uh, that was here. So yeah, it's still possible that we're not going to uh, that we're still going to need lots of, of fishermen for at least one more year then we can drop it back down. Anyway, we are still in August and we're working on the second field. If we get into October and we're not there yet, then I'll go ahead and throw some more laborers in there, or workers. Um, okay, so over here. 
let's I think I'm gonna put all the industry right here and then cattle could even maybe go right down over here somewhere but that will give us some buildings that will look good in, over in this area and I have a good basis of employer or employment right here of, of workers so all these jobs will be filled very easily so I think that's a safe way to do it so let's grab what one mill and thought about that that's probably an out here sort of thing though we do have a void here to fill in we do don't need a road here we've got a road there we've got a road out front of this we could even pop in one more house right there kind of fill in the this corner kind of like that idea if we were to snap you guys together can I stretch you out not enough okay though it is kind of odd to end it right there let's swing back this way can I I probably can't because I'm on the the short side Let me get up in the air a little bit here right there okay so for me to sneak in any further I'm actually out over here um, we are kind of in fact now that I see what our roads are doing it might be kind of nice to have angled this fence out to join up with this road here just wondering what it would look like to do something like that with this one if we were to do this and what rotate like that it's kind of unique let me back up just a little bit you're trying to snap to that one okay so if I were to do something like that I can touch that over just a little bit more but that really wants to force it over there I have to go back a little bit so that's about as far as I can do that yeah that's unique we'll do that so leaves a little pathway through here though we may do something else there what cow shed could almost go there or the uh, um, the hay production could drop in no it can't boy that's a little bit too big okay we'll come up with something over there but yeah that's a unique house we'll do that one uh, don't need to have that one running right now though I'd rather have probably a couple over here going before I get any more in this area going but that fills up that void I need something right here that doors over there so the side is all available and something that fills in basically this run right here so buildings and size I'm thinking this guy is probably too big for that now he doesn't have a pathway through no he's got just a single door okay so he could do something like this really well that would look pretty good okay let's line you up to the grid well how do I get a line there I guess like that actually looks pretty good already um, this was lined up really well so we we're not consistent there though no there's an entrance there that's that's not uh, that's not square okay all right there it is okay you're lined up well Does he go here or does he go here but he's he's a corner hmm I'd say a straight run from the sunflower is going to be right about there. Although a warehouse could do that too. There's always that to remember. Warehouse could bring it all over. In fact, that's one way to keep them employed and keep some, some funds in their pockets is to utilize the warehouse system. In which case, a warehouse and a smaller building right over here might work really well. Okay. Though we have a warehouse right here. There is that. That could supply it right there. Okay. So yeah, we'll put you here. Do I leave a gap at the farm fence? We could. That'll kind of force this pathway a little bit tighter over here. All right. You're going there. And get you going. Let's see here. We haven't actually... Well, okay. The shadows are remaining. That's still a little bug in the game. I'm sure that's probably something that's on the list for patch 5 but it does kind of leave the, the shadow behind when these are picked unless I'm seeing that wrong is that leftover plants that could be the stalks and they're just taking the leaves off I'm, I'm not really sure it looks to me like leftover you know artifacts from the graphic but maybe I'm wrong maybe that's an actually intentional hmm. anyway so there are three fields in August, September, we have October, November here. When we get into November, I'll probably up this number. 
and let more people in. Actually, I could do that now. I see we're not actually using them all. So just let some people phase in and out as they as they wish to. Okay, that'll be fine. So you are there. Um, you could start bringing in Sunflower then. Although, yeah, that'll give them something to do. I'm only allowed four things here, though. Hmm. I was thinking Sunflower and Hemp right in this area might be kind of nice. Huh. Well, let's think about things here. You're going to be there. Um, production. The Weaver's Workshop. So I kicked around something like this in this area. And then another warehouse in the back that would supply these two buildings. Since this can't do both, unless this becomes that warehouse and the building supplies get shifted out to another one instead. That may be something to do. Maybe this one has served its purpose and the buildings around here have been built and it's time to transition that into something else. I'm, I think I'm talking myself into that. That sounds logical. Okay. Front porch. There-ish. Something like that. And something like that. Should line us up well to that run and well to this run. Okay. So you're there. That is the weaver. So we need the tailor next, right? Yeah, tailor's shop. So that faces this way. I feel like this one needs to face this way, but I'm kind of wondering if the other one should have as well. Kind of like that idea. Let's play with that one again. That was the weaver. What if the weaver went this way? So let's do it like so. Well, that place is occupied. It's just in the wrong spot. Okay, what does that look like? That looks pretty good there. But the only place I can really... No, that's got an entrance. So that does mess up. Hmm. What can we trust? Were these set correctly? I think they were. Which means I need to just touch it that way. Hmm. Let's go way past and come back and see if we randomly get a spot that's right in between. That looks pretty good. I think that nailed it. Okay, we'll go with that. And you, I want in here. And I want the porch right at the edge of the road, like so. And I want this guy where? That's right, we're going way out over here now. So that, that feels constricted. Maybe you can be the one that goes over here and the smaller building will be on the corner. Okay, something like that. In which case, I can just concentrate on this alignment here. We'll touch over there, come back, just a pathway. So, out to about like that. And that looks pretty good. Okay, so there's the weaver. Now, can we get the tailor in this space here? Or does he even go right over there? What's that look like? That's possible. The offense right here. That does feel a little bit constrictive now. Although that's as wide as these right here. Maybe once it's built it'll look fine. Yeah, that's as wide as this is and and What else have we got going on here that's kind of indicating road widths? Not much. This right here, I guess, would be. Um, yeah, right in there. That's going to be a road width over there. And this right here, which is wider than what I've done here. Okay. Alright, I'll leave that, but I'm not going to take it any closer than that. Okay, show me the tailor. What do we do here? We cannot go here then. There wasn't enough room. Uh, spin you around like this. That's kind of iffy too. Yeah. That's a little too tight. Okay, then what else goes in this area? We already have the well, we already have the markets. So we'll have to think about what else happens there. Otherwise, this might have to move just to just to look right. You are awfully tight then. Yeah, I gotta think about that. You kind of are. Okay, let's back you up a little bit so we can still see the front of this. All right, so demolish you, and 
Right there, you were turned to face this way. And I'm trying to get some kind of a... Actually, just get down to the horizon as much as I can. On ground level. Boy, it's still hard to tell. Swing around again. And let go. <laughs> there we go. I'll take that. Okay. So back over here. And this time we'll look at it from this direction so we can really concentrate on where the uh, where that is. Something like that. It's not much of a path over on the other side. But between that and the uh, and the uh, field fence. That's a more comfortable gap over here. So what do we look like over there? I couldn't tell that depth. Ah, uh, we'll live with that. That'll be fine. This is a little wider than necessary anyway. Okay, so that's that one. That is that one. We still have a tailor to put in somewhere, and I want to create a corner over here with something. What will that be? We've learned we don't need two of these now when we have this set up for sunflower where are we now? October. That's working out well. Sunflower and hemp. Then they just have to walk over and it goes really quick. And supplies the trader, which has come to a dead stop. It has. Why is that? Because they've started working on other buildings? Not that you'd know it, except for, I guess, this one. No, I think it was there already. Did the farm really suck up everyone? No. They're just on strike again. They do that a lot. Hmm, how are we doing over here? 12 and we're maxed out. So take you down one and we'll forget about that and we'll go into a panic later. Um, actually, once this gets built, then I won't have to do that until we've got 500 in here. Then we'll shut it down for good. Uh, except for firewood, but still 200 firewood takes a long time to work, work through. Now, we're not going to be able to get into any more... Yeah, well, we've already cleaned all the trees out of these. Okay. Not a problem then. Okay. Um, did I shut this down? I did. Okay. Over here, we got three. We got four and five over here. That's probably where the construction crew went, isn't it? All right. So we'll let four do that job for a while. See if we can get back to work over here. Or get this one done so they'll work over there. That's probably what is going to have to be done. It's closer. It's right in the middle of the, all the activity. It's the one they really want to work on. Okay, so we're there, we're there, we're there, and we've still got a few other things to do. So cow shed and cattle yard. Not the sort of thing you want to live across from, but living out here in the outskirts of town, I guess that's just what you're going to have to deal with if that's what we're going to do here. What can we do to clean this up? A cow pasture would do great to do that. So, well, we've seen them sneak through really tiny places before, so that's definitely enough to, to walk through. So, I think that similar void right through here would be fine. And lining up with this one and the cow shed in between. How's that sound? And then, where would the... I guess out in here could be the the hay, and then just put the hay storage nearby. We've got the well right over here, too. That works well with a cow shed. Okay, I think that's going to work. So cow shed there. You right here. And spin you around so the cattle go out that way. Or do we even do it this way? Let's think about that. If we did... Okay, so they, they enter from this end, right there. This end has nothing. Hmm. We'd like for them to enter at the end where the well is. We can't get them over to this well at all. Okay. Though, you know, no reason why we can't throw yet another well in. It costs very little. Um, so we have basically making the corner here with it, and then pasturing in around there or hay storage could be the corner I'll put this over here though we could put a well at the corner too there we go put a well right at their back door okay 
I like that. In which case, I want to make sure this is straight. Um, well, I guess I can use the shadow as a parallel. That looks pretty straight with the, with the map there. Let's go straight on top of it. And rotate, put those guys vertical. Well, the, the shadow just isn't clean enough. There. And I think I need to just touch it. Yeah, probably close. There we go. That's pretty parallel with that. So, okay, we'll go with that. All right, so you... Are lining up right about there. Cattle are aimed away from the houses. Their chutes on the outside, or the other side. And that leaves a little path in between. Right in there. Okay, we'll do that. How big, how big the path become? It's a little one. It's about as little as there to there. That'll still be fine. And then hay production over here, or hay storage. Uh, well, no, it was a well over there. So, this guy. Hmm. How best? Lined up with this corner? Lined up with this corner? Nope, I think I want hay there. Hay barrack. Okay. Turn you... What just finished? The... The uh, warehouse over there finished. Okay. Alright, that looks pretty good right there. So if you came in here, you would probably be sitting about like that. Of course, they're going to cut that corner. If I were to do this... Okay. That looks pretty good. So if I, if I were to put you over here... And another one of you right next to it... They're still going to cut the corner. But that will be fine. And a well over here. How does that look? And spin you around. And right where the place is occupied is where I want to see. Okay, let's change our view a little bit. Okay. So, looks like I need to touch it that way to get it looking pretty straight. And just as we leave that and there is where it goes. Okay. Pause. How'd we do? We did great. And now we need to haul it all in. We still have three that are working their way through there. 639. So we've got to get this finished. Which... Are we working on that now? Or do I need to actually tell them where to go? You... Yeah, let's pause you. And we will pause you. Cowshed will pause. And we'll pause the well. Let's... In fact, let's... We need all these three done, but I want to get this one going now. So we can start making contact. So let's just concentrate on this one. Okay. Otherwise, these guys can continue working in here to bring this stuff in. And then we will uh, get ready for next year. Alright, that's done there. Let's grab... We're not ready for cows anyway because we don't have any hay. So... That's right, I was going to do a shed... Or a, a cow... Cattle field somewhere. I wonder how long I can make it. Hmm. Is that what goes here? Can we get these in here? No, we can't do that either. Anything to move around to make that work? Well, if we could get into both sides of this, you know, there and there by sliding this down, but otherwise I guess we're just going to Sit out something like this. Hmm. Boy, it's so close. I won't do it. I hate setting these in the winter. I want to see what it looks like from this grass out there. So I'll wait on those. Can't uh, do it until summer anyway. Alright, so that's going in. We've got... We did not get the tailor, did we? Let's see here. We've got the weaver. We've got a house. We've got the oil workshop. We've got a cow shed and well and a couple of hay storage. Doesn't make sense to put it in there. It will not fit over here. So Taylor, where are you going to go? Let's bring that up. I want to lean in and put my hand, my, my elbow on the desk, but it changes the way I'm facing my mic. 
it changes the way it sound. Okay, Taylor, workshop. I do want them together, which means I think stored wood, of course. I do want to rotate this back around because I can get it into there. So let's demolish you, continue, and I know I can get it. I want to make sure that nothing's. I'm gonna pause for it. Go back down to speed one for a little bit. I want things to get out from under me while I'm sitting here pondering things. This one is going to be wood. And I'm thinking 500 of it. 500 planks are going to sit in here and be available for whatever future jobs are, are up and going, which means this can go back to two people. All right, so in here also, let's put uh, iron last. But let's put, let's put nails in. Uh, we'll put 1,000 nails in. Well, that takes a lot of clicking. Let's go to 500 nails. All right, no reason for thatch. I don't think so. Now, these guys, well, this one's not gonna be used anymore. Uh, this one, why can't I click that? There we go. That one's going to become sunflower and hemp. So, we need another one of these built somewhere else out here and out there and out over here hmm. okay let's take from other warehouse and take from other warehouse so we can swap things around okay then so I want metal over here iron but what else um hate to do firewood Although it would be very close. it's Firewood's annoying because they only get one at a time. And they make a lot of trips and they neglect all the rest of it. But being right next door, that would probably give us a firewood reserve for the town. That others can grab from instead of here if we shut this down. Okay, we'll do firewood. And kind of that same 500 range. Wish I could just click and hold and let it just start buzzing past or click and move my mouse up or some other way to, to do this. Lots of different ways to accomplish that. And then iron. And we'll put in 10, put in 20. In case we actually become rich one day and buy some extra. Alright, so let's put in just one. He's just going to buzz back and forth. And unless it's a late, couple of ladies in here. Um, we'll leave it like that for a while. This isn't a critical thing. It's just a uh, uh, convenience thing for now. Okay, so what was I doing? I was going to move all this. I was hoping that they would come and take this. I click on that right there. So we have 10 wood that's going to not let me put the tailor in. But I can put the weaver back where I originally had it. Just this time not stuck into the road too far. Okay. So you... That front fence line is actually going to be right about there, the front of the porch. Okay, but I want you this way. So um, what I'm seeing is the front of the porch is going to touch the snow right there, which allows me to get over here, touch the snow, touch what will be the this run over here, which is just into this path a little bit, touch the snow. Right there should be a good corner building. Okay, which means the tailor goes right here, and it will fit now once this goes away. So back to speed two. Um, how best to do that? This place is going to be taken from here forever. If I were to, for now, run this up to 200, she's grabbing five wood right there. Great. It'll be done here in a moment. And then we can get back to finishing this, right? Come on, guys. All right, that's done. So now we can take you back to... Actually, we can just turn that off, turn that off, and that off and tell them to start grabbing um, hemp. There's no... Oh, sunflower hasn't been brought in yet. Okay. Hemp and all you can. Yeah, well, that's probably way too much, but no limits to hemp. Let's bring it all in. And I want sunflower, but that first sunflower field is here. 
Now, these two would have been, so that's the first sunflower. This one went hemp. Okay, so when we get to end of February, I want to rethink what's going on here. All right, trader. Bow out, trader. T, Taylor, there we are. You go here. You rotate your front door. Actually, that was the front door. There you are. No, front door is actually right there. Okay. All right, so line you up with... See the slight touch of a T. Yeah, I guess that's all we're gonna get. Okay, you're there. You're front. Just gonna drop into this area somewhere. Something like that. Gap over there. Let's do it from here. All right, from that corner there. Leave that gap like we're leaving in the other ones. So somewhere like that. But we have steps coming out. So let's take you back just a little bit. All right, you're in there. That'll work. Okay. So that's all the major buildings, right? Except for the shoes and the whole cow industry, which we're not going to do any slaughtering right here. Though we could have done the uh, uh, the shoe maker in this area. He's a little building, too. Does he still sneak into anywhere? Hmm. He does if we rethink this whole thing which case he spins around and and these two run up around here like a uh, like a uh, an old town main street with some storefronts hmm that's kind of interesting hmm so many possibilities. Don't want to be in here. Want main road access for something like this. It could be out in here, though. I do need something to kind of establish a, uh, a road through here. Like so. You know, we got these, these fronts over here all the way down the length be nice to actually there's a something to fill in that void right there with what's that look like over there this is in way too far so he could do something like this except that he uh, touches these two points right here this guy should have been back just a touch more um, see if I can somehow get rid of that no I can't so his the first chance there's nothing in there right now so his first chance is out over here so if we do this we're getting a little tight. We really need to be like right there. All right, we'll do that. We'll do trees and other things right there. Now, what does that look like there? Something like that. It does look a little odd, but actually, I think it steps in quite a bit. I think the the footprint goes well beyond the walking path. Okay, and we still don't have this going. All right, and I can't, at this point at least, say let's hire them at 120 percent. So we're just stuck here. Pause, unpause, in case that triggers the game to dump it back into the queue somehow. Everything, not everything. Okay, let's shut you guys down. Pause. All right, everything is paused but him. We, it's not like we're stealing labor from here. Uh, let's shut you guys down. That'll do it. You're down. You're down. And is that enough? I'll shut the whole town down if I have to, guys. Okay. You're down. You. Gone. Now you're going to build it. Arr. Okay, I haven't missed anything. I guess we just have to give it a week and wait for things to, uh, <clears throat> to re reset themselves. So all that down so that one person can fill one job. <laughs> that kills you. Okay, we'll put two back into here. And we'll leave you off for a while. You're doing fine. Over here, we're bringing in stuff. The iron is in, which means the supply tent went away. Carpenter. We never got the carpenter going last time. 
That's right. Okay. Well, we got to squeeze a carpenter into here somewhere. Maybe that's what's right here. Carpentry right there. Your front door is... Eh, something like that or that. You could go right behind the market. You can even wrap... Well, not really. Well, let me wrap around it, but... Okay. So if we were to put you there, that still leaves... Let's see if we can... That feels crooked, though. What can I compare to? Uh, well, those aren't trustworthy because they flex and bend. So over here is where I need to be. This is straight with the with the map. That looks pretty good. Let me look at it closer. Now we're off by just a touch of T. Yeah, touch the other way. And yeah, we're into that... We're in between two settings. And I can't break through. Okay, as close as it gets. And yeah, I was going to say, did I... Is that really the right rotation? But it is. Okay. So what I want to do is look at it from this angle, sighting my way down the length of those flags. So probably in about like that. So we're going to... So by going outside of that market, we're well within those flags over there. Just to make sure, let's kick it back just a touch. And if I end up putting another market in there... Let's take it back just a touch more, in case there's a, an orange... Well, there wouldn't be anything behind it, or it wouldn't let me in there to begin with. Okay, so we're something like that. Okay, now, where does a granary go? Uh, Trader got done, didn't it? Yeah, okay. Let's take you down to one. We're actually finishing up over here. So, yeah, you're all done. So take all of you guys... Actually, you guys will shut down on your own, won't you? Yeah, you will. Okay, so let's reevaluate things. I don't need to do anything here. We're into Jan. We're just going to start February. We want to get a manager hired here. Get a couple workers there. We want to put in. I want to say 20 potatoes. What do we have here? Why do I not have access to this? Click away. There we go. Potatoes. 15 is all we got out of that crop. Okay, that's got to get us all the way to the following harvest. Hmm. Well, we'll just do five potatoes for now, then. Not a whole lot. Just enough to get a, get a taste of, of the trading. And then I don't have sunflower oil to put into the, the uh, list yet. You have to have it in town before it'll show up in the list. Nothing else here is tradable that I want to trade. Right? Yeah, that, that's it for them, for them. So I don't need two people working there. Okay. Um, I will probably want two people working there when I go to buy things, but there's nothing needed to sell so much right now. All right, so that's happening there. One person. For this one, I'm going to say a man and no laborers. One man with a cart is going to be working here. So let's send her away and bring a guy into here. He can cart larger quantities at a time and for the same salary for one wage. So in that case, I'm going to do that. This one's fine to be a lady. In fact, let's go ahead and make that happen because right there and there, no laborers. Okay, fire you, hire a lady. The pathways are short, so if it's smaller quantities, less weight, it's still going to happen relatively quickly. There's no... The iron is done and firewood nails and wood it's all right here okay so that one's no no problem okay so time to set one of these that was the carpentry yeah let's make that one next and then this guy next for something to trade so turn him on and hemp get that industry going though there isn't a lot of hemp to uh, to deal with right now what do we have in town there you are 15 now Let's verify something. 15. There's 1.4 there. There should be then 13.6. 14. So there's 15.6. And that's showing 15.4 couples being carried. Okay. So it does count both what's in the farm and what's in the warehouse. That's what I wanted to verify. 
All right, now granary, and then probably the uh, the mayor. So if we can get both of these guys moved, maybe the mayor is right in here, the the town hall. Yeah, I kind of like that. So now the town hall right now is it's a double building of two tents, a tent with a porch. That's what we've got. Okay. So where does where do we put the next one of these? We have one there. We're probably gonna want one. Don't necessarily have to have one here. We don't need one here. They're going to grab a cart and come over here, get things, and then drop it off the cart. So we don't want carts here. We do want them with this guy. We want one for these guys. They want to be able to grab... Uh, where to? They need to be able to grab what they, you know, with their supplies and, and then come back. Somewhere in this area. It's either on the back of this or in this void over here. Hmm. You're there. You're well. Let's grab that. That's this one right here. And entrance or access is from that side if we do this. That could work. Although we're trying to establish a pathway line up with this fence here. So it would sit more like this. So he would grab a cart, go and do his thing, drop it off, and go back to work. That seems to work pretty good. More so than going backwards and going in and then backwards. Yeah, let's go along the way so there and we're leaving a gap about like so actually it's over here behind it that works there okay so these two carts there let's put you into here and you into here and we'll tear this one down and set the footprint for the town hall and then this void right here might work well for a granary we'll supply Man, I don't know. I mean, okay, this is a market area here. Another potential market area, I guess, here. These houses. Don't know what's going to happen back behind when all those trees go away. If there's a market over here for these houses, they'll go to that granary. This will go to that granary. Do we put in another granary somewhere else, or is this still close enough for these guys, too? It could be. This going to here for fish... It's still easier than going down there, although going to the... I wonder if, if they will autumn, if they'll default to going to the granary to get stuff, even if it's at the farm closer. Don't know. If once you turn the granary on, it becomes their programmed source. You must go to the granary first. Don't know. But I think this is the place for the granary. So you were in this area. You're right there. And you're in this direction... I'd like to line you up with the map, but I'm thinking that... Well, first of all, there's no room for you. Oh, that well. The original well you can't get rid of. There's no way to sneak it into there. And, boy, it is off by so little. It's off by that little triangle right there. Like that. Huh. Once we get the town hall going, now we, well, I don't think we can even get it into there. <laughs> we spun you around. I mean, we can do something wonky like this, maybe. Even that doesn't work. There isn't a single spot in here that that orange doesn't go away. No, it doesn't fit there at all. Wow. And I'm really sure that's going to say, uh-uh-uh. Yep, I can't make him go away. I don't want to move these houses back. I don't want to. Hmm. But that's where the granary should be. Okay. Doesn't fit in there, right? It doesn't fit there thematically either. But just to make sure that that's... Not a possibility. Nope, doesn't fit there either. He does fit here. That just might be the answer. Yeah, I kind of think it is. Continue to demolish. All right, granary goes there. Uh, you're this one, that one. And spin you around to match what? At this point, we're, we're matching what's out here. Actually, we're matching these guys, which was lined up actually really close. 
Go with that or we go with that? Off this direction or off this direction? There have been times when I've just randomly tapped this guy and he accidentally landed right in between the two, but I guess as close as we're going to get. So... This was the weaver. That's the tailor. That's the shoes. Although it does... I couldn't put it there if I wanted to. It does let us put the little building back into here again if we wanted to. But I think this would look better. Okay. So we'll leave a gap in between. Alright, let's make this front line up well. With what? This one had a porch over it. That little area right there is a porch. So... I think we're back in this area for it. Alright, we're going to touch there. I'm going to kind of split the difference out over here and drop you. How does that look? Gotta, actually, the gap is a little bit... Uh, demolish you. Let's try that again. Uh, Cranary. I want to be more like right there. I need the front to line up right. About there. Actually, we'll put the back of the buildings together. I think that should make it line up pretty good. So you're kind of like right... Th is there a reason for a road through here? I don't think there is. We've got one established there into the farm. We've got one going along the front of these. Do I just establish that there is not a road there by locking this in? I could. Maybe that would look better. Right there. Give us a, a definite gap in between here. So, interesting. The flag's here, but the building footprint's over there, along with that one and that one. Okay. So we do need to kick it back a little bit. You are there. So touch there. Okay, so where the cones start, it's right about there. Well, it's hard to draw back with a mouse and get it straight. All right, let's do this. The center of this wall where my mouse is, is lined up with that fence. Do we like that? We don't. So we want to go back about that far from that center point. I need something that I can... I can use as a as a, uh, a baseline here. So one more time. So that was right there. Now we're going to go back to about there. All right. How's that look? That's pretty good. Okay. Now our fronts are lined up. All right. Well, hopefully that looks good. Greenery is not that important though. So the markets are being supplied by laborers as well. So making that run is not a big deal and we've got nothing to go into here yet but we're going well, we're not going to the next episode anyway okay speaking of next episode it's time has really flown by i gotta get this one done so you are going to pause what's important for next time the weaver going yes the oil workshop going yes um that's that one that one you are the carpentry yep let's get you going too for the plow which means the cow shed needs to get going for the plow Okay, so next time we're in mid-February, let's, uh, maybe between episodes, I'll go through and make sure everything's good here, then we'll get the uh, the next harvest started, or next uh, planting started. All right, so with that, I'm going to call this one done. It's been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time. Bye-bye.